we believe that people is actually the cause of the problem in marine conservation. So we believe also that people is actually the solution of the, the problem in marine conservation. And uh, what we need here is really a change in behavior. years old pa lang yung MPA namin. At first talaga merong struggle. Hindi natin hindi na mawawala yon, may community resistance. Ito that was the time na talagang ang grabe ng resistance ng mga tao kasi first MPA yon na inintroduce ng city at parang ang ang dating ng Fisher Fox amin to eh. But i-deprive sa amin. But kukunin sa amin. So, ang nangyari Nang mag-conduct sila ng public hearing, eh, tinapon silang ng mabahong itlog at saka bato. Yung mga plastic na merong laman na tubig. Uh, kami po ang members sa monitoring team. Uh, din kami mo uh, monitor uh, din sa among mga marine sanctuary. Then, uh, akong makatag o short na brief uh, on sa history sa uh, Tandayag Marine Sanctuary. RARE is a behavior change organization. Um, RARE is a bit different, different to other non-government organizations working in marine conservation because of the social marketing aspect. So, social marketing is, is a strategy in RARE that changes the behavior of our target audience using different kind of social marketing materials. Uh, we, are, we have well-designed posters, well-designed stickers, we have billboards. All these things are actually uh, developed and tailored to changing a particular behavior of the fishers. Dito kasi, yung isip nila, pag MPA kasi, deprivation of the area kung saan sila mag-fish. So, parang deprivation of the right to fish, of the area where they have to fish. So, yun kasi ang nasa isip nila. So, when we introduced the concept of the MPA, parang, okay, but alam mo naman yung attitude ng tao, hindi lang isang ganun, hindi na, it's, it's not just a snap of a finger na bukas, makalawa, okay na. Hindi eh. So, it's a continuous process. Uh, a lot of our marine scientists also are very much happy with that because um, that's actually their challenge also. How they uh, translate their work into something that is being understood by the community. And that is where we as a program implementers in RARE and the marine scientists in the country work together. Last naming question, anong nasa isip nyo? about MPA. Maganda ba siya o hindi? So sila na mismo nagsabi, mas maigi kung may MPA. Being a social scientist who also knows marine science and who also happens to free dive. I am expecting to contribute to this expedition by relating to marine protected area workers and marine science needs to be conveyed in a way that people understand and so economics comes in there and free diving is a skill, an, an inherent skill that they have as, as people who work in the water all the time. Okay, mm -hmm. so resort there, then mm -hmm. the sanctuary came out, then this part of the mm -hmm. resort. Women who are the wives of the, the, of the fishermen mm -hmm. members, because it's a fishermen's association, yes. watch the sanctuary during the day. Well, she doesn't just watch the sanctuary, right? Yeah, she collects well, fees as well. Collects fees. Um, and I think she also assists with enforcement, no? Enforces like the rules? At least at shore, in the shore. Even without knowing the community in Sikihor beforehand, they invited me to eat with them. You know, they were there for a day. 
Um, and some of them in the group knew how to spear fish, so they speared some fish for lunch. They served it to everyone in the group. And when we asked them if we could film them eating, instead of saying yes outright, they said, why don't you come and join us and eat as well? It was really nice to be able to share any moment with them, you know, just, just like that. So Kapit Sisid is a, a network of marine conservation groups and free diving groups. So I tried to link the two together because I believe that free diving can be um, a great tool in marine conservation. It can be used as a skill for tour guides, for reef monitoring, um, and it can be used as a tool for communication as well. I try to translate marine science into money terms. Money is a language that um, let's say policymakers and uh, local government officials understand. Like Martin, because he had his outfit in with parang shades na alike. One of the key principles in Leave No Trace is that you're a visitor in a place that you go to for the first time as a traveler. You have to understand how people move around, what their rules are, what's important to them, what offends them, things like that because you're the visitor. For the sea, it's the same thing. We step into the ocean and we use free diving to be able to interact with marine life, but it's still the same concept. We're still visitors. The awareness is the key to, to having people be more interested in what's my impact. And then eventually, hopefully, that when you start to appreciate it that way, and you're having fun free diving in the water with marine life, you tend to want to protect it.